Hey guys, I'm back. Um, I was just going to show you some stuff that I got that wasn't um, from the from Tuesday morning. Um, and this stuff I got from Joann's and just some random places. I'm not going to name it off because you know I might just randomly find it sitting here by me. <laughs> anyway, um, I will start by showing you some stuff that I got online. Um, sorry, I had to take a sip of my drink. I don't know why I don't do that before I hit start. And anyway, so I made an order for, from Jamie from the Not Too Shabby Shop. And, um, I showed this on that other one that I mentioned on the video right before this, that I made this video already about some hauls that I made recently and I had to really delete them to make man to re free up some of the data that I needed to make a video at a concert I was at recently so um I'm just going to show you these and if I already did I'm sorry but I did get this cute um greeting farm stamp that came out from one of their recent releases called Trishell or Trishell I think it's Trishell let's celebrate and um i thought it was so cute i like the way she's sitting her hair and everything and she's listening to the sea through her seashell i thought it was really cute so i grabbed that one and i had to get this cute little fairy one it says have a very nice day and i love this little um i almost pointed through the phone the other way haha <laughs> anyway this little um dandelion i thought was so cute and look at her oh, her little eyes are closed um she's so cute Believe in magic, little um, fairy light. It looks like a little acorn, but it's a little, I think, a little lantern. I just thought it was so cute. You can put a little crown on it, and her little eyes are closed with her hands. And you could put, like, she's holding something. Um, anyway, I thought it was really cute, and I like the font on that, on both of those. So I thought that was super sweet. So I got those. And I also grabbed these. Um, glaze jelly glaze pens um i want the white ones as well i ended up buying these before but i can't find them and not only that i also got the white ones in this and i thought i got the white ones but they're the clear ones anyway i need to get the um the white ones so i wanted to do um oh, now i'm at a loss for her name she was doing the rock and roll type card challenge and I didn't have a stamp set and I was like, man, I'd really like to do it, but I had no idea what I could use. So I, it just so happened that this just came out from Sunny Studio and it's this stamp set. I just thought it was just so cute. The little cat and dog with the little um, toot box and it says, and she's got a little poodle skirt on. It says, cruising by to say hi, what's shaking? It's got the little milkshakes and it says you're you're swell hip chick cool cat or like you're a cool cat it's got the little cute little cat eye sunglasses little guitar in the little 50s style chevy or car or whatever i just thought it was so cute with little music notes everywhere and oh, look how cute i just thought it was just adorable so i wanted it not just for that because i probably don't have time to do the giveaway now it's gone by so quick. But this was open like this when I got it, which I thought was weird. But I mean, it's new. It's not like it's ever been used. It's just kind of weird. It's called Sock Hop by Sunny Studio. It's really, really cute. So I grabbed that one. And I did get the dies for that. I wish I, I would have got the dies for the fairy. But, you know, sometimes these dies are so expensive. And you try to be really good, you know, and not buy too much. But then if you want, I don't know. I just, I mean, fussy cutting is fine but I would rather have the dies so anyway I grabbed the dies for that and I could not resist this little kitty it is so cute I got this it was a neat and tangled release just came out it's called practically perfect it's got the little kitty oh so adorable and it's got the little chick with the mouse and the little fish it's got a yarn follow yarn little heart and it's got a little thing of milk and it says it you are so you can put you are practically perfect in in every way I just thought it was adorable. So it's called Kitty's Favorite Things. That's by Neat and Tangled. So those are the things that I grabbed from Jamie's shop. I'm probably going to grab some more things. The new Lawn Fun stuff she had out for pre-order. I'm probably going to grab a few things there. I really liked a lot of stuff. So 
I'll grab a few things. And then I also saw that Concord Knight had their, that um, Take a Bow, that cute die that it has where you can make those little trees. I'm gonna get that this year. I saw it came out last year and I didn't get it in time. Anyway, um, from eBay, I grabbed this die. I don't know, it might be crappy, but I don't even know who it's by. I just thought it was really pretty. It's like a, it was like not very much. I don't even know how much it was, but it's like, I should have cut it out so y'all could see it, but I'll let you know next time. It's like a little corner or edge die with butterflies. That was from Dollar Tree. At um, Marshall's, I thought this was so pretty. It says, I love you to the moon. And it's got a blackbird with the moon. It says, I love you to the moon and back again. And it's got like glitter. I love the colors on it. I got my daughter another one. It's really pretty. It's not like this. It says something else. I got one of these for myself. And... I'm going to give this one to my mom. And they also have these notebooks. I got one for my daughter. It's different. It's in there. And I showed it in the other video, but I don't want to drag it back out. And then I got this one. These were only 99 cents. It says love. It's got a feather, of course, since I love birds. I got that one for myself. And then I got this one just to give, like, as a gift for whoever. I don't know who yet. <laughs> who the lucky recipient will be. Anyway, that was from Marshalls. They had a bunch of really cute stuff like that for only a dollar. Um, from the Dollar Tree, I grabbed two of these packs of these stickers. Happily, Ella after on YouTube, she showed these and I just like, oh, I gotta have them. I thought they were so adorable. How cute they are. And I wanted two because I would probably hoard one because I wouldn't want to use them all up. <laughs> I just thought they were so cute, like the color, because I normally don't like these, you know, laser looking ones, but because they're mermaids, I guess, I think they look cute. I like her a lot. And I got these emoji ones. I thought they were adorable. Now, I know Target has the puffy ones. I just saw Creative Young Mama haul them, and I'd like to get those, but I got two of these, and I gave one, or actually I got three, and I gave one to somebody, um... I work with her daughter, who is so super sweet and cute. Hi, Ansley, if you're watching. I don't know if you watch these videos, but if you do, I hope you like the stickers. Um, I think they're super cute. So I got her one of those, too, because um, they're hard to find. Like, I didn't see them at any, all the stores. I only found them at one Dollar Tree, and I went to three. Not specific look, specifically looking for those, but I didn't see them at any of the other stores. And I grabbed a three-pack of these little mini composition books because I wanted to alter it. I grabbed that, and then that's all I got at the Dollar Tree. Now, oh no, I didn't. Sorry, I got two of these. I got these two washies that I... There's the only two I liked out of the new ones that came out. And then um, at Target... I got two of the um, pens, the gem pens. I got the blue and the pink or uh, purple. And y'all know what I mean when I say gem pens, right? I already have a pink one from the Dollar Tree. And I'll show you the purple. Well, it, this one actually is from the Wish app, but it looks just like this, except for it doesn't have that color ink. It's just silver all the way down. I got a. They are dollar fifty at Target. Um, I got these, they're highlighters. They're nail polishes. I'm bringing them to work. I thought they were cute. And I got the donut tape by Scotch. I could not pass it up. I thought it was so cute. I grabbed that one. I'm trying not to buy a lot of washi because I've already got enough. I don't need any more. And I don't, I'm not really a big washi, you know, huge washi. You have to have it. Anyway, I grabbed this. I never showed it. I don't think it's um, by Penny Black. I'm sure everybody's seen this. I just thought it was so cute to make like cute macaroon and Paris cards. So I got that um, from Joanne's. Whenever I did my jo Joanne's order, that's when I got this. I craft so hard. I just like glitter. And I, sh I showed that. I don't know if I if I sh if I'm repeating this. I'm sorry. I couldn't. I don't know if it's one of the ones that got deleted or not. So I did get some of these Nouveau Crystal Drops, and I got, this is Wedgwood Blue, this is 
mm -mm, antique rose. I got bright gold, raspberry pink, mm, buttermilk, sugared almond. No, I couldn't. I just couldn't get my whole hands on all of them. Neptune. I want black. I want clear, like winter something. I want white. Anyway, um. I didn't do too good of a job of showing what they look like, honestly. But if you want to get a good review, go to Dotty Dye's Crafty Corner. And she does an awesome review of these. But this is what they look like. The colors. And I really like it. I mean, they're pretty awesome, honestly. But some of them, like, this is the buttermilk one. Look how nice and melted it is. It's like super pretty. They're like, I mean, you can make your own enamel dots, honestly. The colors are very nice, though. I really do like the colors. They're nice and vibrant and pretty. Really pretty. Anyway, so I got those. And actually, those were on sale at Joanne's when I got them. If you just keep an eye out, they were only $1.79 a piece when I picked those up. So, anyway, I did grab this when I was at AC Moore. And it was the bead um this is the one that has the nylon on it and so it won't mess up your wire and I grabbed beads from there and there were 50 I think I've already shown some of these these are Jesse James beads that I got at Michael's and I wanted to show y'all something so these are ones I got I, and I, I know I haven't shown all these. These beads I've picked up along the way, like at Michael's. These are all Jesse James beads. And I got each one of these for either $4.50 or $5 a strand, which is a good price. Um, every time I got them, they were on sale. So I, I love these beads. They're beautiful. I went to AC Moore, and they had buy one, get one for their beads. And I was like, man, that's an awesome deal, you know? And, Go in there and find some good beads, you know, whatever. I go in there and I find these. And I'm like, holy smokes, man, those look just like Jesse James beads. Like, almost identical, right? I mean, look at them. And some of them are $7.99. Um, the, all of these were $5.99. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you can see. Sorry. They're called Nicole's Beach Out. They're $5.99. These three. I mean, look at this. Do you see this, like, sand look with the thing on the top like that? That's, like, identical to this. If you look. The sand look with, the, with that on top. And if you look at this, that sand look with that on top. It's, like, the same thing. This was $5.99 at AC Moore. This one was $7.99. This one was $7.99 at AC Moore. It's very beautiful. Like, look, it's gorgeous. I love it. Anyway, those are the beads that I've picked up lately. I told y'all I've been getting beads. Some of them I've already shown. Those are like the major big beads. And I'll just show y'all that I, oopsie. I've also got this. And these have already, probably already shown. I have shown a lot of these to other um, haul videos. But, like, just recently at AC Moore, they had the buy one, get one. So, I did get these rondelles, I think they're called. And they're, like, a pink. I got those. And I got a strand of these. They're, like, a gray. And a strand of these. They're, like, oopsies. Like, almost purple, gray and purple mixed. And these were on clearance. They look like diamonds, like the shape of actual diamond. Oh, they're so pretty. And I got those for $3. And then these are very pretty. I got those for, they were in like a strand. Anyway, that's kind of like what I've collected with my beads and what I'm trying to. Um, and this was the smaller size of the rondelles that I got. So they had really good, they were buy one, get one. Anyway, so that's pretty much it.